he has a routine that he does before every race that is as much mental as it is physical, right? It's an activation kind of thing. So the first thing I'm doing well, when I'm going to like the, the room call, um, it's just like a breathing exercise. Uh, this is like helping me like focus on myself. He sits in a yoga pose, basically, you know, with his thumbs up like this and his fingers kind of done like that. And I always call it levitating. I'm like, well, go levitate before you swim, right? Because he's like sitting cross-legged, you know, you feel like he's just going to come up. <laughs> so he has, and he does deep breathing and does all those things. So he has that, you know, that's a part of his process. What's happened next is just like, not, not even thinking about all the people like what they think about me and anything. Uh, that's why I'm uh, like my own pace. I'm not even watching like around me. It's just like the lane and the wall, you know. <laughs> uh, that's how I can be way better uh, by just focusing on how can I go faster and touch the wall like before everyone else. Leon, you know, has worked for years with a a mental coach. I started that because in 2000, I think 20, uh, it was like a tough year uh, for me was during covid and um i just i was not improving anymore um i didn't take a break after world junior so i was like very tired of everything uh so i was not going fast faster and he used to have a big problem with nerves at the big meets when he was younger uh, so i started working on like my mental head um and i've been like game changing like actually like definitely like very worth it. <laughs> um, and since that, I've been like having a lot more fun in like dual meets, uh, swimming meets and stuff. Um, and I'm just more relaxed. I'm just doing my thing. I'm not watching anyone else. Uh, I don't care about all the people, what they are thinking of me. And I mean, yeah, just, I think that's like the main, the biggest step I, I took. Uh, like my mental is so much better now. Uh, I'm still calling this guy like every week. He's like my friend. Um, and yeah, he, he worked a lot with uh, Fer Fer Manadu too. Uh, mm -hmm. I think you know this guy too a little bit. <laughs> um, and yeah, we I improved a lot on that thing. And so that has really helped him be able to get in the right uh, sort of state to perform at, at the World Championships and the Olympics and the NCAAs and all the other things that we do. I think this is one of the, this is like 70% of the performance. Like when you go to like a final at world championships where like everyone is like very nervous and stuff. I was just like doing my thing. And I was just like having fun, you know? So I think that's how, how I did it. It's, it's, that's remarkable. And more people need to realize that. And, but I also know it's very, very difficult and it's a journey and you're still on that journey. I bet, you know, and um, it's probably one of the hardest things you got to get through and still getting through. So yeah, kudos to Yeah, because we train like maybe five hours a day in the swimming pool, uh, but we never train our like our mind. So uh, I've been working on that since like two years. Uh, yeah, this is definitely like game changing.